Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Hi everyone, I hope you're having as a good day as possible or I hope you've had the, um, as good day as possible and um, today um, has been a nice day um, in the Midlands. Um, no rain at the moment so which is always a, pl a plus point uh yay <laughs> and um today i'm going to be doing a vlog on uh, travel news worldwide 10 exciting facts march 2021 part eight so just before we jump right into it, if you could please subscribe to my channel, it's the red and white subscription uh, button at uh, box and um, it's free to subscribe. Also click the notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming uh, videos or any videos. And also um, I would like to um, invite um, everybody to join uh, my membership channel. There's, um, start from 99 pence per month again there's more information in the uh, description box below or it's next to the subscription button um, which is um, blue and white so um, now let's fire away um, with uh, some amazing brand new facts um, which is number one industry urges government to focus on testing over quarantine a single on arrival antigen test is as effective as a 10 day self isolation period in reducing um, important at cases of COVID-19, new modelling has um, agreed, argued, so uh, again it could be again another way out um, and again it could, uh, again it's going to be another way of testing and finding out um, people that are coming back and um, into the UK uh, still and um, who's got COVID and who's not so I hope it does go ahead so I think it will be better um, in the long run and uh, number two American replace cares, Carers Act at uh, loans within new fundity um, american has completed a 10 billion dollar fight nansen deal backed by its advantage program the carrier said um, it will use a portion of uh, the proceeds to um, prepay its, its secured loan from uh, the u.s treasury so uh, that's really good news um and um i hope it goes as well as possible number three wt wttc records at us 4.5 trillion dollars is tourism losses for 2020 unfortunately vast losses run up at last year points the first full picture of the sector struggling to survive um, in the face of crippling travel restrictions and unnecessary quarantines um, so I mean I, a lot of um, countries are struggling um, all over the world and I really hope um, the travel industry and the hospitality industry and any other industry um, for 
or countries around the world um, um, as soon as possible um, start to reopen and um, come back from the uh, from a terrible year last year. Number four, Nakheel offers a final palm tower apartments to investors so I hope that goes as well as possible and number five P&O cruises reveal Arthur will sail uh, from the Caribbean so good luck to P&O cruises and Arthur and the Caribbean for that fingers crossed it goes as well as possible Don't Number six, Morocco minister argues confidence is returning to Alfred. To sorry, um, Morocco minister argues confidence um, is returning to Africa's uh, tourism market, which is again really good news uh, for Africa and the tourism market in Africa in general. And good luck to, as well to Morocco for that. Um, hope it gets up and running as best as possible and as soon as possible. Number seven, CNA uh, says Teletext um, has failed to provide customer refunds. It's a, 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 a real shame. Um, I hope soon. Uh, teletext will provide the customers the refunds because last year I had and my brother and myself had a uh, terrible trouble of uh, getting refunds back uh, for holidays um, number eight Rwanda Air vaccinates its staff against COVID-19. Well, well done to Rwanda Air for that. And a good luck in the future. Number, tar, uh, number nine, Qatar Airways to return to my NOS as a Greek, tour, as Greek tourism reopens. Oh, well that, that's uh, good luck for Greece and Qatar airways for that and hopefully um, the customers uh, will enjoy uh, the Greek islands and um, from Qatar. Number 10 last but not least Aer Lingus which is an Irish, Irish airline to add for new trans Atlantic routes uh, from Manchester and um, so um, good luck um, to Manchester Airport and um, Aer Lingus um, for that in the future um, adding four more new transatlantic routes and I would like to say to everybody uh, thank you for watching um, and um, I'll see you tomorrow um, for a another travel video, which is go going to be my travel and lifestyle channels um, improvements, updates, and more. So please stay tuned for that at six thirty tomorrow at GNTV time PM. And I hope everybody's had as good day as possible thank you and bye for now thank you bye